When you're handed the reins to a colossal franchise like DC Universe, you've got a target on your back. That's precisely where James Gunn found himself after stepping into the driver's seat. But let's be real here, Gunn hasn't exactly helped himself. His statements, his social media musings, often conflict leaving fans scratching their heads. Case in point, his recent gripe about cameo-packed superhero movies. Many folks actually agreed, maybe, just maybe, DC could steer clear of what Marvel's gotten into, right? Then we look at the confirmed cast for the standalone Superman Legacy movie. It's a laundry list of characters. Now, Gunn's comment about hating cameos comes back to bite him. Why? Because he previously hyped up The Flash as one of the greatest superhero flicks ever. And trust me, that thing could easily be labeled cameo porn. Okay, I get it. He's heading the studio. He's got to play the game, promote the film. But there's a massive difference between saying it's all right and calling it the holy grail of superhero movies. Now, he's clarifying stuff over on threads since he ditched Twitter. Not the best move when you're aiming for clarity. Barely anyone sees those comments. And it gets even messier when he defends the extensive cast, claiming they're not cameos. But come on, isn't that what he called cameo porn? Confusing, right? Now, Superman Legacy holds a lot of weight. It's a chance to set the tone for the DC Universe. And honestly, the casting looks solid. But how it translates on screen, that's the question. Gunn's got a lot to prove, especially when his own words seem to contradict his actions. And you know what? I think a lot of that cameo talk is just him throwing shade at Marvel. This whole DC journey ahead, it's going to be a bumpy ride. But hey, let's see how Gunn steers through it all. So what do you make of this tangled web? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. And hey, don't forget to smash that like button, subscribe, ring the bell, and share this video. Catch you later.